Could I ask the student up on the right uh, to ask her question, please? Yes, uh, mic number three. Uh, please go ahead. Good evening, Mr. Lee. I uh, understand that for economic and demographic reasons, Singapore has allowed a high number of foreign immigrants within a short time period. Um, so uh, my question is, what can we do to promote uh, a sense of belonging and foster social cohesiveness in the next decade? Thank you. Could I first ask you to identify yourself and could you tell us if you, uh, which nationality you come from? Uh, I'm Singaporean and I'm a PhD student from the School of Biological Sciences. Well, I have some bad news for you. <laughs> Not because I disagree with you that we must have a sense of cohesiveness and we must assimilate the new migrants that were made into Singapore citizens and the permanent residents who hope to become Singapore citizens. My worry, looking at the demographics, is that we are fast aging as a population. The birth rate today, fertility rates, is 1.01. .01. In other words, for every couple, you have 1.01 .01 baby. <laughs> so, instead of a population pyramid like that, you will have a diamond-shaped pyramid, inverted. Having said that, the Institute of Policy Studies have the grim statistics of 60,000 migrants a year to keep our economy young, or our people young and economically active. We can't digest that. 20,000 maybe, 25,000 at a stretch, but certainly not 60,000. So, in other words, we are going to become because it's politically indigestible, otherwise, to take in these numbers, a shrinking and aging population like Japan. How old are you now? Uh, I'm 27 this year. You are? 27. 27. Are you married? <laughs> no. You are doing a PhD? You are doing a PhD? That's right. Uh, yes. Yep. Well, when will you finish your PhD? <laughs> um, in another two years. So you'll be 29. <laughs> Have you got a boyfriend? Uh, no. <laughs> well, the childbearing years are uh, about 35. <laughs> After 35, the dangers of having a Mongol children, a Down syndrome, in other words, a dull person, rises. So, my advice is, please don't waste time. <laughs> It's more important and more satisfying than your PhD. <laughs> but good luck to you. I hope you get your PhD and your boyfriend. 